Yeah. Yeah. Hey. Feeling young, but they treat me like the OG. And they want the tea on me, I swear these bitches nosy. Said he put some money on my head, I guess we gon' see. I won't put no money on his head, my niggas owe me. I gotta be single for a while, you can't control me. Who no those traits in a race, they can't hold me. And I show my face in a case, so you know it's me. Imitation isn't flattery, it's just annoying me. And I'm too about it. And the dirt that they do on my name turn to soil, and I grew up by it. Time for y'all to figure out what y'all gonna do about it. What is up beautiful people? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm Jania if you're new to my channel and I am back with another vlog. So right now I am on my way to Walmart. I haven't been on the camera because y'all honestly I'm tired of looking the same. Like I'm tired of my hair. I need to wash my hair. I don't have a hair appointment until next Wednesday. So that is honestly why I haven't been on a camera. Y'all haven't seen me. Like the first time I picked up my camera to start this vlog was on Sunday. I've literally been in the bed Monday and Tuesday. Today is, no, I was in the bed Monday. Today is Tuesday. So it's only been one day, but I don't know why it feels like so much longer. But right now I am on my way to Walmart because I have to get a few things to cook. I but I think I want to do, oh my fucking God, bro. All right, the car has stopped. So hopefully I don't have any more mishaps with this damn camera. Cause like, it seems like every vlog that I do, like my camera is falling. So if you are a content creator or if you are a vlogger and you use the Sony ZV-1 and you have a car mount, like please comment down below what car mount y'all use and i'm going to go and get that thing expeditiously because i'm so tired of this camera like falling every time i try to record a video but like i was saying i haven't been on the camera because i'm so tired of like seeing myself with my hair like this like literally when my hair not done i get so depressed like i be so depressed my hair is not done my nails are not done and i feel like i need to like pepper myself i'm really gonna do that on sunday though because like i just been so busy like trying to get measurements for my couch like that's another thing that's stressing me out like i want this couch i've been looking at this couch and like i have my eyes set on this one particular couch and i feel like it's going to be too big for my space so i'm going to go to rooms to go tomorrow to see like what I can do if I could take one of the pieces off like how we could finesse this because like when my mind is set on something and I really want something like it's like I don't see nothing else like I want to love every single piece that I get from my apartment so if y'all haven't seen a lot of like furnishing content it's because I'm really taking my time with it um and just trying to pick out specific pieces that i really love and that i'm really going to enjoy so like i said right now i'm at walmart about to get a few things i think i want to cook the hot honey chicken that i cooked in my last vlog because when i tell y'all that chicken is like a hit so i'm gonna cook that again tonight with some fries and yeah tomorrow is going to be a better day i'm not going to record myself cooking because y'all already seen me cook this meal so tomorrow is going to be a better day i think i'm going to take myself out on like a little solo lunch date because i definitely need it yeah i'm about to go in walmart and if i don't talk to y'all again tonight then i will talk to y'all in the morning because like i said we are going to be busy tomorrow so yeah i'll talk to y'all soon just got back from Walmart and I'm gonna show y'all what I got so we got some Lunchables brown and serve sausages these are really good we got some Roger Wood sausages these are like the best sausages so Jimmy Dean sausage I make like this dip with this bread we got some chips we got some chicken wings oil Rotel for the dip waffles cream cheese cookies these are literally like the best cookies ever last but not least we got a summer celsius so good 
This is my favorite flavor, the peach vibes. And I also like tropical vibes as well. So, we like all the vibes. And yeah, that's it. So, I'm going to cook and get ready for bed. And I will talk to y'all tomorrow. closet because I am about to get ready to go on me a solo lunch date and I was trying to figure out what it is that I was going to wear but I think I'm going to wear this black baby doll dress it's a little bit hot outside but it's not like unbearable so I think I'm going to put this baby doll dress on I got it from a pretty little thing and then I think I'm going to wear my Louis Vuitton tennis shoes let me show y'all put my Louis Vuitton tennis shoes on because I need a pedicure so bad and I am not trying to have these toes out. But yeah, and I'm going to put my Louis Vuitton tennis shoes on. So, and that is what we're doing. My closet is like, I have stuff everywhere. I got clothes here, clothes here. It's a bin right here. I got clothes in there. These are all the clothes that I actually hung up. And then I have my shoes up there and I also have stuff in my beauty room so yeah y'all i just i'm all over the place i got stuff everywhere and we may do some closet organization and like me finishing hanging up all of my stuff in this vlog maybe if i have time but right now we ain't doing it so yeah i also wanted to show y'all these um i think it's called van cleef and arpel bracelets these are dupes so I got two. Y'all know I love this green. So I got green and I also got black. And then I also got some hair oil that I think I'm going to be putting on my hair while I have my braids in. And I got it from this company called The Glam Room. So my friend recommended this um, hair growth oil to me because I've had thin edges for so long since I was a little girl. And 
I just needed something that's going to grow my hair. So the ingredients are peppermint oil, lavender oil, rosemary oil, castor oil, aloe vera, and sage oil. So she have different size bottles. I went with this one at first just to see how I like it. And then I will get a bigger size if I actually like it. That's that. And then what else? Oh, let me tell y'all about this couch. So I'm going to rooms to go today to see if I can probably finesse this couch some type of way to see if it's going to fit. Why is this blinking? I don't know. But finesse this couch to see like if I can put it a different way because this couch is detachable. So it basically can go many different ways but i had my i'm gonna take this i'm gonna take my camera down i had my um maintenance guy come and excuse me do measurements of my place to see what size couch i can actually get in here so let me turn my camera around this is the space so he said basically I would have to get a nine by seven. So nine inches going this way. And then if I get an L, it would be seven inches going this long way. So hopefully I can find me, like if this couch does not work at all, hopefully I can find me a couch that I like. Because as I told y'all before, once I find something that I really, really like, it's really hard for me to set my mind on something else so i'm gonna go to rooms to go see what i can find what i like and we'll go from there so yeah i'm about to put my clothes on and right now it is about it's almost 12 o'clock because i said i wanted to be out of the house by 12 it's 11 49 so i'm about to put my clothes on <clears throat> get in the car and then i'll see y'all once i make it to the restaurant i'm gonna go to this restaurant called peppermint thai it's a thai restaurant and i love their chicken pad thai so that is what i'm gonna get so yeah i also think i'm gonna take my laptop as well so that i can work on my media kit and yeah just run a few errands today so i'll pick y'all back up once i get to the restaurant all right so as far as outfit of the day i have on my shades i have on my baby doll dress, bag, shoes, and then for my fragrance, I have my Atrape Revis by Louis Vuitton. So, yeah, that is the look for today. It's a little dark. Ooh. Yeah, it's a little dark, but who cares? This is cute, and this is what I wanted to wear. So, yeah, we're about to head out, so I'll see y'all in a little bit. A table for one, please. Yeah. Don't cause you know it's
Alright y'all, so I just got done eating. That food was so freaking good. I'm so full. I did try to make an appointment while I was sitting in there to get my nails and stuff done because my nail shop is literally right down the street from this Thai place. But the lady who I go to, she don't have no appointments. So I'm not going to be able to get it done Friday, Saturday, or Sunday. So I think I'm going to just go next Thursday. Because I get my hair done on Wednesday and I'm going to get my nails and stuff done on Thursday. And probably do like a little maintenance vlog or whatever. So, yeah. I literally just got my car washed and when I came out. I literally just got my car washed and when I came out like. A freaking bird boo booed on it. But. I may just go get it washed again because I have like a subscription or like a membership or whatever. I canceled it because I live like further away from the place now. But I have until May the 2nd to use it. So I'm going to get as many washes as I can out of it until it's done. But yeah. So I'm about to get ready to go to Rooms to Go to see what's up with Rooms to Go. And... If I don't find like another couch that I like or if this couch does not work, then I'm just going to go somewhere else to try to find a couch. I'm going for that like cloud couch type of vibe. So if I can't find one at Rooms to Go, there is a city furniture across the street. Not a city furniture. I think it's a city mattress. I don't know if they got furniture in there or not. But I'm probably going to go there. And then we're going to go get us a matcha. <laughs> y'all knew that was coming so i'm gonna drive because y'all know this driving and vlogging do not work for your girl so we finna go to rooms to go and i will pick y'all back up once we get the rooms to go I'm doing good how are you I saw the couch before at another rooms to go and I think it's gonna be too big for my living room I had my um, maintenance guy come by today and measure my living room and he said that um it needed to be something that's like a 9.8 by 7 or something like if I do an L shape or for my back wall it needs to be like 9.8 or so gotcha. But I know that couch, like you can configure it different ways. You can put different pieces with different pieces. So I'm just trying to see like if I could try to finesse it some type of way before I decide on another couch. Oh yeah, this is, I think this is the couch right here. So the wall part is nine by eight. And then if I do the L shape, so this part would have to be nine by eight. That L shape would have to be um, like seven feet. Gotcha. So the limiting factor we have here is that. <laughs> yeah, because even I was trying to see if I could even get, because I know these two pieces right here are like one piece. But then I was like, well, I don't think it was going to, I don't know. We can do those pieces with individual arms. Um, in which I could push the couch over a little bit like I still have a little bit more space because it's 9.8 but then how would you how would you say how would you do it so I mean the, the, I could do three individual seats because even small, but even then if you're talking about the nine, 9 foot 8 inches or 9.8 feet in, at best it's still not going to fit because you're over 10 feet with the smallest way I can do three seats on this couch oh my god the best that would fit would be one seat and then the wedge to bring out another seat this way. There's no way with any of the pieces for this one to fit all three seats on that wall. Not unless you have another foot tucked away somewhere. Yeah. Do y'all have anything similar? Because I'm looking for that cloud couch type of like cloud couch, I guess, type of vibe. So gotcha. The closest thing I have that might be able to make fit would probably be this one here. 
Uh, it's, a, it's a bit of a different system because the seats drop back and forth to give you the depth of something you're looking for on that. Uh -huh. so you'd have to look at ones that have the sleeper pull out, but even then, I don't think any of the ones I have with the the option to pull out those extra pop up cushions is going to fit on that nine foot space. Okay, so this one, and then I'm saying like another I would arm. Bet, yeah, it would just be mirroring this on the other side. So flipping this, you'd have an arm here. And it would be these two seats. And we might be getting somewhere, y'all. So y'all, we got the couch. I'm so happy and excited. It should be delivered next Thursday coming up. So Thursday's date is uh, the 21st. So the day that I plan on getting my nails and stuff done is the day that the couch is gonna be delivered. So. Yeah, I'm going to finish filling out my paperwork and stuff, and then I will talk to y'all when I get in the car. Hey, y'all. So, we just made it to Starbucks. I am so freaking happy that I got my couch finally. I knew I needed to go in the store to kind of see how they can configure the couch before I ordered it online. But let me order my drink, and I'll be right back. Hold on. Yeah, y'all. So, I knew I had to go in to see how they can configure the couch because yeah it's so big but it's so comfy like that's what i wanted a very comfortable couch something that was real cute and modern but something that was very cozy and comfortable as well so yeah like i said before the couch is going to be delivered on thursday so i'm so happy but i'm not going to be rambling too much i just wanted to you know let y'all know what was up and tell y'all that I got my couch and yeah I'm about to get my matcha go to the house edit some videos and probably try to see what I'm gonna eat for dinner tonight thank you can I have a straw thank you have a good day matcha secured <laughs> about to go to home goods and target because i need to get some smell goods i need to get some plugins and i want to see if my home goods has those sand and fog candles because i heard they smell really good so yeah we are on our way to home goods and i will pick y'all back up once we get there i love these shades y'all they make me feel like a bad girl i'm a bad girl not a sad girl <laughs> <laughs> I'm outside in a AMG Right outside TT Two turn baby girl you know me Still with the dolls that I grew beside All the niggas round me I and it died Gotta watch the time cause it's flying right by I'm outside in a AMG Right outside I went inside of home goods but that line was so freaking long like I was not about to stand in the line for one candle so I put that candle down and I went to Target so this was like a smell good Target run so everything that I got besides like the paper towel and paper napkins was like smell good stuff so I got these Airwick plugins vanilla and pink papaya these are the plugins these smell so freaking good i love these so much deodorant wax melt by febreze this was on sale for $2.99 it was originally ten dollars and it was on sale so i picked this up these wax melts so i got cozy cashmere and i also got Sunkissed Kiwi Tropical Breeze and Coconut Sherbet. It's three that come like this. I guess you could just like cut each one and put it on the wax milk. Paper napkins, toilet paper. So yeah, that's everything that I got from Target. I was trying to like get up out of Target because I really think I have social anxiety. It's something that I haven't like talked about a lot. Like when there is a large group of people like piled up in one space. Let me know if y'all get like 
my chest like tightens up so much i get so much anxiety from just like being in public places and i don't know if that came because of what's going on in the world like different shootings and stuff like people can be going out shopping and people are like shooting them or whatever but i have gotten really bad social anxiety that is everything that i picked up from target and that is going to conclude this week's vlog don't forget to like comment and subscribe and also turn on your post notifications so that you know every single time that i am uploading content also be sure to follow me on instagram at all eyes on underscore gg for all of my pictures and content as well i want to thank you all so much for watching this vlog and i will see you guys in the next one